Have you ever struggled to lose weight and you're trying to figure out what can I do to make the hunger stop? You might have a problem with a hormone called leptin. Hi, my name is Dr. Anna Toker, your friendly neighborhood colorectal surgeon. And I talk a lot about diet and nutrition in my medical practice and then also in my medical spa for weight loss patients. Leptin is a hormone that is created by the adipose tissue, your fat cells, and it tells your brain that you're no longer hungry. The wheels can kind of fall off the train in modern life as we are exposed to stress, toxins, and a lack of sleep. All of those things interfere with hormonal pathways. So if you're struggling to lose weight, you're exercising, you feel like you're eating proper, this may be a leptin problem. As of right now, we don't really have a good answer to leptin, but you can do the following, and this has been shown to naturally improve your leptin responses. First of all, get quality sleep. Make sure you're sleeping in a dark room. Turn off your phone. Get blue light filters for your computers and your phones. All of these things help improve sleep quality while you sleep. Leptin and ghrelin reset and get back to normal. This helps control your metabolism and your hunger response. Make sure you avoid processed foods. Processed foods are made with a lot of artificial things, but they're also made with a lot of seed oils, including canola oil, which is a fat. Your body doesn't really know how to digest proper, properly. It has inflammatory molecules to it. And I know the label says, oh, it's good for heart health. But once you cook it and apply heat, it becomes inflammatory. Stay away from seed oils. They can be the cause of you having hormonal imbalance. Make sure you're drinking plenty of water, making sure you're getting great exercise, diversify your, your diet to get a good microbiome base. All of those things will improve your weight, your quality of life, and yes, your body's response to leptin.